Here we are. Street Fighter 5 Summer Update. New characters. We's on countdown. 1 minute 46 chat. We eagerly await. Don't mess around with some of this stuff. Ooh, the countdown. What we got in the chat here. Uh, I don't think we'll get... I don't think we'll get Q. Great Street Fighter week. You've already got a character in G. Which is very similar. Um, if I had to bet one character, I think we're going to see Dan. He's such a nostalgic character for the franchise. Uh, a lot of people love him. Not one of my personal favourites. Uh, believe it or not. But 1 minute 59 seconds. 30 seconds. <laughs> the music's ramping up. 20 seconds, let's go. Looking forward to seeing. I wonder if they're going to say anything about netcode in this. And how many characters do we think they're probably going to show? This could be could be quite a big update. This quite a big reveal. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. <laughs> Here we go. ストリートファイター5様アップデートへ。ウェルカム。え、番組をご覧いただきありがとうございます。本日はたくさんの情報アナウンスしたいと思ってますので、ぜひお楽しみください。ロドヴェン、ロドヴェンアナウンスメント。
this character is returning from Street Fighter 4. Have you figured it out yet? No. Okay, I'll give you another clue. This character originated in the Alpha series. Hmm? Getting Rose? Going, are we? All right. Last clue. This is a big one. If you she was in Alpha, yeah, and she was in Street Fighter for it. Look behind you. Somewhere in this background, I have decorated this room with the biggest clue, the most tell-all clue that just gives it right away. I'm looking. Scan this room. I'm looking. Have you figured it out? Street Fighter 4. I see it. Somewhere in the background. I see it. If that's what I think it is. Time's up. And I think I'm right. Let's see if he pulls this out. This will be interesting. <laughs> I've gone rose. I think I see a rose in the background. I am proud, happy, excited to give to you someone you've all tried tricking us there. We all the characters. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. Rose. Cool. Rose is coming back to the Street Fighter series. That's the Alpha music in the background. Is that Alpha 3 music in the background? Content, trailers, etc., etc., etc. This is go for broke guys. For the Street Fighter 5 series. And until then, Rose is a good inclusion. All that stuff. Matsumoto-san, Nakayama-san, I leave this in your capable hands. Thank you guys for having me appear tonight. Until next time. See you soon. I'm Kenny Omega signing off. Cheers, Kenny. Woo! <laughs> Here's the boys back. Rose, I'll be, I'll be interested to see. Um... I've never been a massive Rose player, but I know she's got a massive fan base, and uh, I think they'll make her look pretty cool in Street Fighter V. I can't wait to see her. Uh... Yeah, she's a pretty unique character. They could do, I can imagine him being able to do some crazy shit in Street Fighter 5 with her. More so than they could do in 4. Alright, so she's going to get her own stage as well. That's interesting. Very good. So we've got another, another stage. Third character. Shit, we're getting spoiled tonight, guys. Street Fighter 3. Oh, gonna be Dudley. Wow, Oro. Out of all the characters so far, I'm interested to see what he's going to look like the most because Dan and Rose have both had iterations in Street Fighter 4, so they've had been updated through the series, as well as Oro. He's never been in the game since Street Fighter 3 Third Strike. Look at his sprites here. He's going to look sick, in fact. They can make him look sick. Never played Dalsim's story actually, so I didn't realise he was actually in some of the cutscenes for uh, Dalsim. That's interesting. Oh, yeah, sure, that's a favourite food, too. He does some crazy shit. Crazy shit. I can't wait, I'll tell you what I mean. I can't wait to see his supers. I bet his supers, they can, his supers could be very interesting. Thank you too, man. I think that's it. For the three characters that are announced, fantastic. Really, really good. One more character. What the hell did they reveal in the whole entire season cast? All oh, right, okay. So this isn't from Street Fighter, Capcom brand. 
Palmer ディレクターから。Oh, please be Palmer Stone. Please be Palmer Stone. It's not going to be Palmer Stone. I can wish. Please be Palmer Stone. シリツ、ジャスティス学園から、おあの、カザマアキラが参戦することになりました。アキラカザマ。ネバー、アンネバー、リビンマシファラライブルスクール、ソンノアオポネ、オビスリー、ヤー。The main thing I would say while they've tied her is, in, is obviously Sakura comes from rival schools, so I would imagine she's got some sort of connection with her. Here we go. So she was acquaintances with Sakura in rival schools. Yeah, so it's easy for him to tie in. God damn it! That bored it meaning for Goddamn Stone character. I know Rival Schools has it. got its、uh, niche audience, but for me, I don't know.、I'm、sure, it's an older game than Power Stone as well, so. Power Stone has just been forgotten, man, hasn't it? Capcom have just lifted up the rug and swept that shit under. Some good characters. Some really good characters, though. How, I just hope they play as well as what. I just hope they play as well as what、uh, Seth and Gil did in the Champion Edition update because they completely changed the game for me. I thought they were the best two characters in it. Completely different to anything else what's in the game. And I think Rose will be like that, and Oro, which is why they've thrown them two in there. Danny's obviously got his, you know, fireballs and things like that, but he, is a complete, he plays a completely different style to what a Ryu or Ken does. So get, they've gone with some different, a different set, which I'm really I'm pleased about. I'm pleased. Totally different style to the rest of the game. Okay, so we've got some decent、uh, limited time offers here by the looks of it as well. All right, so you can do the upgrade kit for. Or is this. Oh, okay, so it's just for the Champion Edition. So, yeah, they've put the discounts back on. Champion Edition, uh, uh, by the way, guys, all free trial as well、uh, starts August 5th from today. I would recommend Champion Edition, this version of Street Fighter V, to anybody. It's got the best characters. It's, I think it's been obviously had all the bits ironed out. It's still a little jinky every now and then on the、uh, online net play, but. Which fighting games aren't really until they crack this rollback shit. Can't wait to see some of the footage on the other characters. We've seen a little bit of Dan, so、uh, oh, here we are. Done the roadmap. So this thing is at least going towards the back end of 2021, which is, tells me something very interesting. We'll have a look at,、uh, take a look at that back in a bit. Yeah, in the future, we'd like to share,、yeah, use this format. To... I think it's cool. I think it's been a cool little reveal. I think because it's been held back, they've been able to release, like, like gives us an idea of like, quite a few of the characters coming out, which has been pretty cool as well. Feels like you're actually getting something instead of drip feeding the odd character here and there. Thank you very much. Yeah, thank you guys. Thank you guys. It's been cool. Yeah, Champion Edition,、uh, 40 characters, 34 stages, 200 costumes. Thank you for watching. Okay. That was sick. Okay, so let's have a look at this timeline. So,、um, obviously, this is coming towards the back end of this year, winter.、Uh, new character, we've got Dan. Four costumes.、Uh, oh, and they're doing, obviously, a new、uh, Capcom Pro Tour stage for、uh, 2021. Uh, new costume, sporty, nostalgia, and a fan design one as well. New battle mechanic and new battle balance. That's interesting. Then we're going into spring.、Uh, Rose is going to be brought out. Obviously, five,、uh, five costumes. She's going to have her own stage. And so, three new professional costumes. Then we're going into summer.、Uh, so, in the same season, there, we're actually going to get Oro and Akira Kazama. Uh, Oro, by the looks of it, isn't going to have his own stage, but Akira is. I would imagine it's probably going to resemble something a bit of the rival schools. Pretty, it could be pretty cool if they do it with like the cage round.、Uh, and then we're going into fall 
um, which is the final character which they're not previewing yet. That's obviously um, a little bit of a secret coming up. I don't know when we're going to hear about that. Probably not till close to the time, actually, or around about this stage when these guys are released. Uh, we've yet to see any gameplay footage of these guys. We've seen a little bit of Dan. Looks pretty sick. I do like the uh, character design they've gone with. I think out of the four what have been shown f so far of Dan, Rose, Oro and Akira, uh, the two I'm most looking forward to is Dan and Oro. I am looking forward to Rose as well. It's just I probably will never play her. She's not my style of character. But I do think they'll be able to do some really cool shit with her. Uh, especially with the scarf and everything, how she can, you know, absorb the fireballs, take the energy, and I think some of her specials will be good. Akira, out of all of them, I'm not really that bothered about. I would love them to have put a um, Power Stone character in there if they're going from another franchise. Uh, never going to happen. That's my personal opinion, anyway. Love Power Stone. I was never a massive fan of Rival Schools. And then we've got the new character, which is very interesting. Now, this takes us all the way through to Fall 2021. Okay. Fall 2021, for me, tells me we are probably not going to get a Street Fighter 6 until probably the back end of 20, 2023. Uh, I think if we... I don't know if... The, the thing that I'm trying to get my head around is I don't know if all this stuff was planned from Capcom before we got hit by a uh, deadly virus what nearly wiped out half the planet. Um, all the COVID stuff went off. We all went into lockdown. And then halfway through, was it about halfway through lockdown, we got this announcement that Street Fighter V was going to be having another final season and more characters. Everybody, including myself, I even did a review on the game, which you can see up above, up above on, the, uh, on one of the cards. Uh, I'll put the link to it there. Everybody thought that this game was done. Street Fighter V Champion Edition, we thought was going to be the definitive, you know, like almost the Ultra Edition finale of the game in its final 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 state uh you've got obviously two big bosses in there like gil and seth which sort of felt like it finished the roster off and sent it in a new direction brightened it up in my opinion because i thought they were the best two characters what they added to it everybody else just felt a little bit samey throughout the different types of characters um and they made street fighter 5 enjoyable again and i thought that all the updates they did to 5 it made it the complete package if you was going to buy Street Fighter Five now, I've said it before, absolutely go for it. The Champion Edition with 40 characters, all the stages, all the costumes, you can't go wrong. Uh, and then, of course, we're getting this, which is going to be an add-on for Champion Edition. I think this will be the end of Street Fighter Five. by the way, at the end of this. I can't see him flogging this out much longer. Uh, but, we're, you know, we've got until probably this time, 2021, before the last character is revealed, which says to me, Street Fighter 6 is still a long, 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 long way off, unfortunately. But it is what it is. So, I thought it was a pretty good reveal. Uh, Dan, as I said, and Oro, I think Oro will be sick. We've not seen him since the Street Fighter 3 Third Strike, so I cannot wait to see some uh, gameplay footage for him come out, because some of the crazy shit he can do in Third Strike, I, will, I can't wait to see portrayed in a 3D sort of environment that Street Fighter V is. Uh, so for all stuff what's going to be coming out of Street Fighter V, I'm sure we're going to get some new character uh, videos soon, especially after this reveal's just come out, showing you what some of the new characters can do, especially Dan before his release. You know what to do, guys. Hit the subscribe if you haven't already. Tick the bell, which will give you notifications for when all these videos get uploaded, uploaded and you can stay up to date with everything we do on the channel. Once again, guys, thanks very much for dropping by. I'll see you in the next video. Stay safe.